Hey everyone. Welcome back. In this video I will teach you an easy way to do cinematic lighting in Unreal Engine 5 using Lumen. So let's begin. I am using this environment from Marketplace. You can download it from the link I have given in the description. For the main key light I am starting with a rectangle light and place it where I want the moon to be in the scene. And I will adjust the intensity and attenuation according to the scene. Lumen is enabled by default in the project so to turn it off add the post process volume and enable infinite extant unbound. Go to GI and select none. I will enable it later as per my need. Now I can focus on placing and adjusting the lights. Let's change the color for the light. As we all have been seeing in almost all the films the nighttime is always represent cool, which is true in temperature wise. So let's add bluish tint in light color, and later I will also adjust the tone for the whole scene in post process. Our main light is done. It's covering and highlighting the main parts of the scene as I want it. Now to add variation in the blue light let's add some additional orange lights at fire area and in the hut. So I have placed the lights where it makes sense. Now time to turn on the lumen and see how it will affect the scene. Results are pretty good. Let's look around and see what else we can change in terms of lighting. Now time to adjust the indirect light intensity for all the lights according to our need. As you can see I haven't had any skylight in the scene, so I have to lift up those shadow areas through the indirect light or GI. scene is lit up perfectly and I am happy with results. Now we can leave it like this or just by adding a little fog, but I want the foggy atmosphere, so let's add the fog. With this light setup it will not work when you add it. Because there's no any directional or skylight in the scene. So to make it work properly select the fog and go down. Check the volumetric fog. Now the fog will appear in the light areas. Now it's about doing experiments to get desired results. I can't give you the specific values for their settings. Just make sure you play with the fog settings in the lights and exponential height fog settings.
scene is looking much better. Now all I have to do is some color grading by adjusting the contrast bloom and all. That's it for today's video I hope you learned from it. You can also suggest what you want to see in the next video. Make sure to subscribe and like the video and also share it with everyone. I'll see you all in my next video.